Isaiah chapter 27, Leviathan slain. On that day, the Lord with his harsh, great, and strong sword will bring judgment on Leviathan, the fleeing serpent, Leviathan, the twisting serpent. He will slay the monster that is in the sea, the Lord's vineyard. On that day, sing about a desirable vineyard. I, Lord, watch over it. I water it regularly. I guard it night and day so that no one disturbs it. I am not angry, but if it produces thorns and briars for me, I will fight against it, trample it, and burn it to the ground. Or let it take hold of my strength. Let it make peace with me. Make peace with me. In days to come, Jacob will take root. Israel will blossom and bloom and fill the whole world with fruit. Did the Lord strike Israel as he struck the one who struck Israel? Was he killed like those killed by him? You disputed with her by banishing and driving her away. He removed her with a severe storm on the day of the east wind. Therefore Jacob's iniquity will be purged in this way, and the result of the removal of his sin will be like this. When he makes all the altar stones like crushed bits of chalk, no Asherah poles or incense altars will remain standing for the fortified city will be deserted, pastures abandoned and forsaken like a wilderness, calves will graze there, and there they will spread out and strip its branches. When its branches dry out, they will be broken off, women will come and make fires with them, for they are not a people with understanding, therefore their maker will not have compassion on them, and their creator will not be gracious to them. On that day the Lord will thresh grain from the Euphrates River as far as the Wadi of Egypt, and you Israelites will be gathered one by one. On that day a great trumpet will bl be blown, and those lost in the land of Assyria will come, as well as those dispersed in the land of Egypt and they will worship the Lord at Jerusalem on the holy mountain.